herzlich willkommen zurück bei einer weiteren Folge von Life is Strange. Previously on Life is Strange. What did you find? Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. We can't trust anybody except each other. You know more about her than me. No. You and Chloe think you know more than anybody. Like all teenagers. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. What are you doing in my dorm? You are so fucking dead! Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. What are you doing here, Max? Victoria has to be next. What a lame gimmick. Rachel, why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Oh. <gasps> Rachel, what? I'm sorry, Chloe. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I know you're close to Nathan, but your life is in serious danger. Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Oh! No! Chloe! Look how! What the fuck? Natürlich müssen wir das nochmal sehen, Alter. Life is Strange ist ein Spiel, die den Spielerentscheidungen die Geschichte beeinflussen. Die Folgen all deiner Taten und Entscheidungen wirken sich auf Vergangenheit, Gegenwart und Zukunft aus. Wähle Weise. Ja, das werden wir tun. Holy shit. Ah, oh, ey. Wir konnten nicht zurückspulen. Wir konnten einfach nicht, weil... Weil wir unter Drogen gesetzt wurden. Und ich, es scheint so, wenn wir äh, halt eingeschläfert werden in diesem Sinne. Ja, wir wurden ja halt völlig aus dem Leben geklatscht. Können wir nicht zurückspulen. Ich glaube, dafür haben wir dann halt sofort keine Kraft mehr. Aber eine Nadel einfach direkt in den Nacken oder in den Hals rein. Oh, ich stelle mir das so widerlich vor, ne? Life is Strange, Episode 5, Polarized. Und das ist auch die letzte Episode von Life is Strange. I hate 
looking at myself like that. You'll pay for this, Jefferson. This is piss, Kent. God, I don't remember anything that happened. This must be the same drug Nathan used on Kate. Oh, shit. Jefferson kidnaps Victoria, too? This is so bad. Victoria, wake up. Wake up. Shit, okay. Oh, shit. That's so, okay. Jefferson kidnaps Victoria, too? This is so bad. Okay, mit dem Rollerwagen können wir nichts anstellen. Right in front of me. Huh. Great. I can see all my things, but I can't grab it. Nichts machen. Wir müssen was machen können, oder? Also wir, wir können. If I could move it towards me. Okay, es hat wohl irgendwas mit dem Bollerwagen zu tun. I promised I would never go back in time like this again. But this is the only way. Ah. Perfekt. This angle highlights your purity, see? The slightly unconscious model is often the most open and honest. No vanity or posing, just pure expression. Oh, Christ. Look at that perfect face. Dieser kranke Bastard. Hold that stare there! Stay still! shot but please don't worry we have all the time in the world for now i knew you were special the second i saw your first selfie yes i still hate that word but i love the purity of your own image not like rachel who was always looking in the wrong places poor rachel Let me try this angle. Don't move! Oh. Uh, much better. Thanks, Max. If only Nathan could see this setup. He tried so hard. But you can't just throw a few subjects around and expect a cohesive style or theme. But he had an eye for shadows, and an eye for a whole lot more, as his elite family will find out, along with Arcadia Bay. Nice. Oh, good. Oh, those eyes. It's just too bad you're so goddamn nosy, Max. But this room is under 24-7 surveillance, so all I had to do was text you from Nathan's phone. And you fell right into my hands. You really should have focused on schoolwork, not private detecting with your little friend. Chloe. 
Chloe. Right. Yeah, I'm sorry that I killed... that Nathan killed her in self-defense. But she had a troubled history like most Arcadia Bay dropouts. Nobody will be surprised. Or care. Though I promise, people will care when you die tonight, Max. I wasn't lying when I said you have a gift. Okay. Now this looks good. Maybe a few more close-ups. Max, please do not move so much. I need you posed and framed my way. Maybe a new dose will calm you oh, down. No. No. <laughs> Now, don't move, or this will hurt much. Stupid bitch! You just don't listen, do you? In fact, you never did hear much in my class. If you had, you might have seen all this coming. God damn, you are a fighter, though. I've had my eye on you, and I've noticed that you've been more fearless this week than maybe your whole life. Remember my number one rule. Always take a shot. I'm definitely more awake in this photo. I could try this one. This might work. Please work. Okay. I'm getting some spectacular images here, Max. Yes, Victoria would kill to be in your place, but she doesn't understand our connection. You're the winner, Max. I choose you, your portrait. Fuck you. You're trying too hard. I know you're scared. You all have the same doe-eyed look when you wake up here. Replaced by fear as you realize what's about to happen. Mr. Jefferson, why are you doing this? Oh, Max, I'm so glad you asked that question. Uh, simply put, I'm obsessed with the idea of capturing that moment innocence evolves into corruption. That shift from black to white to gray and beyond. Most models are cynical. They lose that naivete. However, some Blackwell students carry their hope and optimism with them like an aura and those lucky few become my models my subjects yes you're a psychopath and this is your last session au contraire max i'm so sane that nobody knows what's happening to you right now as you can see sleeping beauty here is too harsh for my gentle lens and don't get me started on your late partner. I had enough of those faux punk sluts in my Seattle days. Go to hell. You will for everybody you've hurt. Unlike pure sweet Kate Marsh. I don't believe in that bullshit. She could have been my masterpiece. The world is what an artist makes it. And my muse. 
artists don't drive teenagers to suicide for any bullshit views. You trained Nathan to drug Kate, to take photos of her. That's why she's dead. Which makes me sad, Max. I will miss her. Kate had such a strong spirit. It was very satisfying to break it down. You will not get away with this. I want you to know that. Too bad you already made a convincing argument against Nathan in the principal's office. Thank you so much for setting him up for me. I do know that the Prescotts are going to have a major scandal when the town finds out what their elite son has been doing for homework. Sie haben Nathan benutzt. You used Nathan. I prefer the term manipulated. Like with an image. Nathan's was easy to twist around. I became a sort of father figure for Nathan. It happens often in teacher-student relationships. It was kind of touching for a while. Did you tell him everything about your plans at Blackwell? Don't be stupid, Max. I told him what he needed to hear. In return, I had access to the Prescott fortune. Who do you think paid for this glorious darkroom and equipment? How else could I get all these hip new drugs for my subjects? Rachel Amber was your victim, not your subject. Oh. Rachel Amber. Vielleicht kann er sagen, was passiert ist. That's the real tragedy. Nathan thought he could be an artist like me. Instead, the dumbass gave her an overdose. Chloe and Rachel. Chloe and Rachel. You killed both of them. They're fucking together in heaven right now. Is that what you want to hear? Why? 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 Start listening to me, you dumb cunt. <laughs> I'm sorry, Max. <laughs> that was not cool, anyway. Rachel is dead. But no tears. Los Angeles would have killed her anyway, so look at this as a favor. You're evil. Oh, I see. You and your friends almost beat Nathan to death. See, we're not so different. Yes, yes we are. I cared more about Nathan than you did. No, you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic what I do with the camera and subject, like father, but not like son. Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. Do you finally get it now, Max? I can't compromise my vision with amateurs. You are an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. You can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't care what you do to me. You're gonna die, motherfucker. For Chloe and Rachel and everybody else. I do love your spirit, Max, but you brought yourself here by your own choice. Anyway, I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. Okay. Now, let's see how these shots came out. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your work out. Was ein Pisskind, ne? I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. Oh, now this one. This is purity personified. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your work out. Mist, wir haben den Moment verpasst. Okay. Wait. Please, uh, Mr. Jefferson. Max. I would love to talk shop, but I really need to go over these pictures. Especially while they're fresh in my mind. I think our session was a career high for me. You... you still have my diary. 
don't worry. Nobody's going to read it. Thanks for reminding me. There's nothing more innocent than a teenager's diary. Oh, look at your selfies. What a waste of talent. Look at that shot, Max. You can do so much better. Yeah. Jetzt kommen wir da raus. Nur, wo wir dann hinkommen, das weiß ich nicht. Ich habe das Bild nicht erkannt. Oh mein Gott. I could go all the way back to the moment this all started. Max, this could be your chance to fix everything. This for good. Purity personified. Uh, um. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb I'm word back. for a wonderful photographic choice. Right back where I started this insane week. Dr. Jefferson. And nobody is going to hurt Chloe ever again. Portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Er war ein Visionär, nicht einfangen. Nicht einfangen. The Daguerrean process. He was a real visionary, not a hypocrite. Uh, <laughs> what do you mean by that? I mean that he actually created something. He didn't just take pictures of models and pretend they were art. I'm not sure I get the connection, but, uh, yes, the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear, defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max has clearly read more into them than I have. Hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday time Heroes. To change time. The winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the First, Let's Let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. And Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Bastard. Das ist echt so richtiger Bastard. Okay. I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. All I need is David's number, and Jefferson is one text closer to life without parole. Suchen? I should be able to track down David's number from the school pamphlet. Das ist nicht die Schulbuchische. Ach so, das sind Seiten. Meet your professors, Mark Jefferson. Found you. Yeah. For once, David, I'm praying you'll overreact to this as much as everything else. And take Jefferson down fast. You wanted me to enter the contest, asshole. So maybe I'll be going to San Francisco. And Jefferson, you'll be going to prison. The past within the past. Am I pushing myself too hard? It doesn't matter what happens to me. I have to save Chloe. Hi, Kate. Oh, hey, Max. Kate, listen to me. I am. Always remember that you're not alone. I've got your back no matter what happens. 
So do a lot of other people. We all care. We're all here for you. You need to know that. Max, that makes me feel so blessed for the first time this week. I, I don't know what to say. That's okay. Neither do I. Maybe we could both use a hug. Thanks. You always know the right thing to do. Okay, ich weiß zwar nicht, ob es sie zurückbringen wird, aber es kann ja sein. I'm happy to fix it, so you'll be here to get your fancy camera, Victoria. Victoria, it's nice to know how you really feel. Oh yeah, okay. Mein Handy ist platt und mir ist langweilig. Zeit für, po Zeit für Poesie. Warum gab ich das Wort für das Bild auf? Weil ich kacke bin. Aber Mark Jefferson ist klasse. Alle hier lieben ihn. Aber er scheint sich nur für Max C. zu interessieren. Ich will sie hassen, aber es wäre ihr egal. Neid ist eine Sünde. Vic, krieg dich wieder ein. Okay, gut, 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 gut. Also, wir gucken hier nochmal kurz. If only I could tell the whole class about Jefferson and watch him squirm. But I better let David take care of everything. Yeah. The 90s are over for you, asshole. Oh, wie aggressiv die jetzt ist. This is the last time somebody bullies you, Kate. Ja, wenn wir sie damit wieder ins Leben holen, ne? Also Victoria, I'm sorry you have to stand next to that psycho. Mr. Jefferson, we need to talk. Uh, Can you see I'm talking to Mr. Jefferson now? Yes, I see. But maybe you shouldn't. Uh, and why not? Hold on, Victoria. Are you okay, Max? I will be when Victoria understands that hiding behind a screen, posting videos of people is incredibly cruel and unfair. You're smart enough to know how easy it is to hurt somebody. To destroy their life. I just want you to think about how much it would hurt if somebody did that to you. You can always make the right choice, Victoria. I know you've got a good heart. I've seen it. Listen, I... I didn't... You don't have to explain. There's no reason for you to be so insecure that you can't be happy with your own talent. Wouldn't it be better to lift people up than to bring them down? You could inspire people. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about now, do I, Mr. Jefferson? I think I should stay out of this one, Victoria. Then I guess I'm done talking. And that's okay, too. That was kind of random, Max. What did you mean? Here's my photograph for the Everyday Heroes contest. Oh, uh, that was easy. No, it wasn't easy at all. Well, I, uh, I, I can't prejudge yet, but I'm very happy you decided to enter. That means a lot to me. And Blackwell. The, the first step for any artist is to put themselves out there in the world without fear. To be innocent. Or guilty. Uh, well, thanks for the photo. And maybe both of us will be jet-setting to San Francisco this Friday. Or maybe only one of us will be going. Don't be so modest, Max. Anything can happen in a week. As you're going to find out, Mr. Jefferson. Okay, er war auch nicht so positiv davon. Okay, das ist... Hä? Okay. Aha. Nice. Nice. 
this. Sie haben die Leiche gefunden. David hat seinen Job gemacht. Das Foto sieht cool aus. We did it. Aber das kann es nicht gewesen sein. Da kommt definitiv noch was komisches. Wow. Okay. You're okay, Max. You're safe. On a plane. I hope I did everything right this time. Good work, David. Chloe. Oh, you're alive. Oh, you're alive. Almost in San Francisco. I'm so stressed, but I'm so excited too. The beginning of the end for Jefferson and the Prescotts. Uh, to Moon Diner. Inmitten all der Umwelt, uh, Umwelt Chaos in Acadia Bay, wie Schneefall außerhalb der Se uh, Season und gestrandete Wale berichteten. Berichten Einwohner gestern Abend gegen 20.02 Uhr zwei Vollmonde gesehen zu haben. Zeugen geben an, dass die Doppelmonde klar am Nachthimmel zu erkennen waren, bis nach kurzer Zeit Wolken aufzogen. Das Ausbleiben von Video- oder Bildaufnahmen veranlasste örtliche Meteorologen zu der Annahme, dass die Vorstellungskraft aufgrund der neuesten Öko-Chaos Öko übersteuert. Blackwell Sicherheitschef entdeckt Bunker und Skandal. Im Verlauf der Untersuchung diverser Hinweise von David Madsen, Sicherheitschef an der äh, Blackwell Academy, fand die Polizei am Dienstag eine bizarre Kammer im Untergrund, die angeblich von Lehrer Mark Jefferson und Schüler Nathan Prescott benutzt wurden, um junge Frauen unter Drogen zu setzen, äh, zu entführen und zu fotografieren. Obwohl an den Opfern keine weiteren Anzeichen psychischer oder sexueller Gewalt festgestellt wurden, schockierten diese Enthüllungen das beschaulichen Städtchen Arcadia Bay. Selbst gegen Sean Prescott, einflussreichster Geschäftsmann der Umgebung, wird jetzt wegen seiner Rolle als Besitzer der Scheune, unter der sich die Hightech-Dunkelkammer befand, ermittelt, wird auf der nächsten Seite fortgesetzt. I have to admit, I love being called an artist. Okay. It's so weird to be in between realities. Everything is out of focus and in the distance. Ten across six letters. How the hell am I supposed to figure that out? Das haben wir uns angeschaut. I have to admit, I love being called an artist. Aw, oh, I haven't seen Hot Dog Man in forever. Chloe and I used to totally play the video game and watch him all the time. <laughs> when we were innocent. So please, don't. please fasten your seat and stow oh, okay. any electronic gear until the plane is on the ground and at the gate. Thank you. We're starting our descent in a few minutes. <laughs> 
It's a beautiful day in San Francisco with clear skies and cool 60 degrees. We hope you enjoyed your trip and we thank you very much for choosing Pacific West Air. Come fly with us anytime. Uh, I don't think so. I'm hoping these airline seats get smaller so I won't have to fly at all anymore. That's not I bet this is a nice break for Principal Wells. After all the damage control he had to do this week at Blackwell. <laughs> ja. Gut. Ich würde aber sagen, wir starten ganz schnell in die nächste Folge. Ähm, ich bedanke mich auf jeden Fall recht herzlich fürs Zusehen. Und ich sag mal, bis gleich. Tschüss.